Hey everybody! Welcome back, Wealth of Nations EU4 multiplayer featuring myself, Northern Lion, as well as Quill, Arumba, and Mathis. Say hello. Hi. Hello. Hey there. Sweets, let's let's continue. So I'm getting really annoyed by these religious zealots in Cantabria. It's the second time I've landed on them and they fight me back because they got a six fire general and I can't get <laughs> military access to Castile. So I'm getting the minus two crossing penalty. It's awful. Wasn't that Venice's? What was? Cantabria. I thought you were like gonna give that to Venice or something. Nope. No. I, I separate pieced out early and was able to take that. No, my mistake. Yeah, because I was looking there and I was like, why does Quill have 94 boats blockading nothing that I can see? I was like, is he at war with France again? Is this guy trying to like sneak behind our back and <laughs> take some more French land by breaking truce? Yeah. But That's no. actually what's happening. It's <laughs> a genius idea. Yeah, I just saw your your army just got routed and it's walking through my land all the way yeah. home. That's so <laughs> annoying. I'm talking about a walk of shame. Um, Good thing I had the boats there, because otherwise they would have just gotten flattened. So, I was sizing up Northern Lion because I have a feeling that he's going to backstab us, and he oh, has that's, really, really good troops. <laughs> that's bullshit propaganda. And, and, and he, has the alliance, he has the alliance with Russia. So, yeah. that needs to go away. Because... He's got the manpower of Russia to back up his really good generals. Yeah. It's dangerous. It's very dangerous. I think he could take all three of us. I actually do. Especially if we're fighting know, I, like appropriate terrain. The only the only thing I think we could do that might make us win would be to starve him out income wise. If we could starve him to death. Cause your income is really, really high. Mm-hmm. And mine is twice as high as Northern Lions. Mm -hmm. Just throw money at the problem until it goes away, like in <laughs> politics. How are, how are you going to starve me out, though? Yeah, that's that's what I don't understand either. <laughs> like just just issuing an embargo like, each good, or something. Uh, I don't know how that works. Uh, are you not familiar with looting provinces and how? Oh, uh, I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, All you'd just... have to do is run some some troops through there. The looted modifier is nasty. Let me find one. Might be a good time to check and That'd see be... if Russia would join a war on Italy. No. <laughs> I'm just, we're just talking. Oh, it's just, yeah, just, theory crafting. Just, just spitballing here. I'll figure it out. <clears throat> of course, the, the one time I'm trying to find a looted province, I can't find any. Oh, there's one. The looted modifier. Nope, that's uh, apparently Stora Kaparbergit. Kaparbergit. If you do it. Word. My only suggestion is maybe wait until you can run fast enough to get away from Forced March. Uh, yeah. Alright, so looted modifier. Minus 10% goods produced, minus 50% local tax modifier. So, most of his income comes from taxation and production. He only makes 20 ducats a month from trade. Just saying, Quill, just, you know, as an idea. Uh-huh. That that's that would be the way. <laughs> you can hire a lot of mercenaries. I'm I can hire you, a lot of mercs. This, this is, is for true. You to do. Oh, I, it's my responsibility to take on Prussia. Prussia yeah. and I've been bros, man. We've I been very know. good to one another. I, I'm pretty sure it might be time for the uh, Mediterranean powers to feel the bite of the Germans. Mmm. Yeah. Let's not forget that we have some kind of uh, familial relationships. That's true. Oh, with an That's enormous dirty, the way you say it. The largest land power plus the largest sea power. That could cause some problems. Mm hmm I thought Great Britain was the uh largest sea power. Uh, they not a I think in this game? I'm pretty sure the Hansa in this game is better than Great Britain right now. Why am I forcing it? Aw, I just died. <laughs> Let's take a look. Navy. Total. Yeah, I have two hundred and thirty four. Great Britain has hundred and two. Mm -hmm. Italy is the neck is number two position at 144. They have almost twice as much wow. as the second naval power. As far as ships goes, yeah. Just total ships. Total ships, yes. Uh, you have 45 heavies though too. I do, which is very significant. I just unlocked two deckers too, so I actually have to upgrade. God, it'd be nice if we had the expansion where like I could actually just upgrade them the way I would want. I know what you mean. I agree completely. 
But I can get another idea group. I have to figure out what that's going to be. I feel like it's going to be Diplo, because I'm quite far ahead of that. Plus then, I could take maritime ideas. Although the humanist ideas are kind of cool. The naval ideas are kind of cool. Just something more military might be useful. God knows, we're yeah. kind of coming to that point. I'm, I'm to the point now where I'm, I'm thinking more like, which one do I want to take, considering we're probably not going to be able to finish it? <laughs> you know? Like, what, what has the better first few ideas? Right. Oh, I should take one that just makes my uh, mercenaries cheaper and better. I'm just going to take administrative yeah. ideas. That wouldn't be a terrible idea. Innovative's not bad too, but... Boop. Yeah, it's that time, isn't it? I'm probably <laughs> going to have to go with uh, quantity, I think. Hard to say. Defensive was an idea too. What, Denmark left the coalition against me? Really, Denmark? You want to get your butt kicked? Is that it? <laughs> oh, Regency Council. <sighs> See, I think it's too late in the game to try to take offensive. I wouldn't know because I got it uh, ages ago. Yeah, yeah, you've you've had it for a while. We mm -hmm. all know. Yeah, I was just making sure that it's <laughs> common knowledge. So the the aware. best part of offensive ideas is uh, forced march at the end. Is it exactly? Mm. Oh, all right. Yeah, yeah. force force march, pretty good. Yay! No more regency. Really. <laughs> Oh, you're right. There is, uh, there's something to owe about. Uh huh. What? I'm, I, I owed about that recently myself. What happened? Oh, nothing. Yeah, Stop nothing that. <laughs> Everything's fine. I see you're eating Ukraine. Is that that's not what you're talking about? Oh, no, that's something. That purple color. Oh, hey nut. Mm -hmm. Hey nut. You're an all star. Get your game <laughs> on. Go play. No. <laughs> I feel like the truce timer interface could be a whole lot better. You would, Quill. I would what? Ally them. <laughs> they offered me, they asked me. I, I was 88% sure. of the way through my claim fabrication. Oh, you were going that way. Mm. Oh, that's funny. I was very, very close. Oh, well, there we go. Then. Well, then I'm really happy. Not to, like, sabotage your reputation or something. Oh, God. Stupid espionage powers. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have any active rebels? Yes, I do. Where are you? Down there. <laughs> Alright, Ottomans, I'm just gonna attack you. Oh, Mathis is finally done preparing for his war with the Ottomans. Oh, I was doing other things as well. <laughs> Come on now. Give me a little credit. Mathis, I wish you the best of luck against the Ottomans. Oh my god. Maybe I'll just wait. I'll just wait, alright? <laughs> Military access from the Timurids. What have you done, Mathis? I haven't started anything yet, so. Oh, nothing. it was a Roomba. Started some kind of war with the Timurids. Some kind of holy. Yeah, some kind of holy war. Hmm. The Timurids almost... are real large. Holy wars, best Say. wars. Crusade would be nice, but I am not Catholic. It's after 1650. Still, a crusade would be nice. <laughs> oh, you're right. I guess I can't disagree about that. I don't even. I didn't even realize or actually remember that there's a deadline on crusades. Yeah, who plays? Why aren't there crusades these days? It's 2014. We should have a crusade. 
some people might suggest there have been. Uh, yeah, I can enact yeah. Sunday schools. Cool. Chairs are real squeaky. Squeak a deaker. Uh, I just realized I might not be recording my audio. Hmm. Oh, Mathis. <laughs> all day? I can't. I, no, 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 not all day. Uh, this this episode. I don't know. The audio is minimized, so I don't know. I hope I am. That'd be frustrating. God we'll find damn out it. after. I'm a slob, man. I'm sloppy. <laughs> People aren't going to totally get the full value out of those Ottoman jokes. I know. Ugh. 19 legitimacy. No, oh, you must really sleep around or something. Yeah, I have some royal marriages. <clears throat> well, it's been fun, Ukraine. Oh, my hair cat. How can you... That's through a closed <laughs> door in, like, the <laughs> other room. I just heard her. <laughs> you, are, you, you are wrong. I'm just impressed. Which one was that? That was Ruka. Oh, uh, Ruka. Yeah, that was Ruka. Stupid cat. He's very vocal now. He's a talker. Yeah, he's a big talker. Ever since Nick oh, left. No. I think he was trying oh. to keep it inside. Suddenly, I'm not recording anymore. What the oh, fuck? my God. <laughs> yeah, suddenly. No, I was, and now I'm not. Wow. You're not very good at this whole YouTube thing, are you? <laughs> I don't know what happened! <laughs> Trick number one is starting to record. Oh, it's so frustrating, though, when something goes wrong. Or the worst is you record, like, four sessions and then discover something wasn't right. Yeah. Like, uh, then you're like, do I just, you know, put in this gap? Or do I find the save and restart and pretend nothing happened? Oh, uh, and Audacity's just closed. So, I don't know what happened. Something I've, happened. I've had enough. <laughs> I just, I, this episode's a wash for me, so hey, you know, whatever. I'll put in like a post, like something for last episode to be like, go watch everybody else because my recording fucked itself. <laughs> Why did Audacity just close? Whatever. Go Ottomans. Windows is trying to save power. I hit the Windows key. <laughs> Probably. I feel like the Grand Shipyard is very underwhelming. 150 ducats, and all it does is lower ship build time by 10% and ship cost by 10%. Not as grand as you if, might imagine. Yeah, I guess if you're making lots and lots of ships, it might make sense, but you want to build them out of multiple provinces, so it's, I don't know. Yeah. All right, I'm going to war. Here we go. Guess who Mathis is going to war with, guys? I mean, the French. That would right. be pretty sweet. <laughs> if this were, uh, like, Hoi 4... Hearts of Iron for like, or Hearts of Iron in general, like serialized production lines, then it makes a lot of sense to have things like Grand Shipyards. Mm. Oh, really? Like, we're going to be building the same pro product for the next 20 years. Well, or actually in that game, like for the next three years. And that means a lot in that context, right? And then it gets better and better. Like, it starts off slow, but then as they optimize all the lines, so you want to keep producing the same thing for a long time. So then it would make sense to have something that specifically gave you um, a boost in one place. <laughs> sure. I've read, I read about that a little yes. bit. I'm excited about Hearts of Iron 4. Oh, yeah. It does sound pretty fun. Yeah, yeah, I think it's going to be cool, too. I hope it's it kind of does what EU4 did for Europa Universalis, and people are going to be mad at me for saying this, but making it a little bit more user friendly so dumb idiots like me can actually get past that awful you know yeah, they, learning hymen they, they, <laughs> <laughs> they didn't really dumb down EU that much but they made it so much easier to understand what the yeah. hell's going on you know yeah it's still a lot of mechanics I don't disagree there Of course, Greek nationalists pop up when I go to war. Why wouldn't they? You're going to be able to win this war against the Ottomans, Mathis? The Ottomans. <laughs> you got it. 
I think I'll be all right. Hmm. I don't even want much of theirs. I just want some coast, uh, like one coastal province. Could try and just take them all, like totally out, but. I don't think you can do it in one war. Nah, I probably need to do two. Do you know what their capital uh, is? Uh, Izmir. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's bad placement. Oh, Truce is up with uh, Castile. Nice. Interesting. Problem is that they have that alliance still. With France. So, hey, uh, you guys want to go kill the French army for me again? That'd be nice. <laughs> I can hey, tell you where they 1, are. I just gained 1,678 ducats, guys. That's a pretty sweet deal. That's quite a bit. Sweet. Sorry, Quill. Oh, yeah. Prussia <laughs> sabotaging my reputation. I told you, it had to be done. Such a scumbag. Hey, you pulled an equally sneaky tactic allying them. I know what you're talking about. Man, they do really like you, though. Didn't work as well as I thought it would. I guess because you're not technically neighbors. Oh, maybe that's true. You have exactly, like, one province bordering on each side, which is absolute horse hockey. Horse hockey. <laughs> okay. You Canadians in your hockey. Just a good expression. You know what I'm what I'm saying, but I'm putting it in a <laughs> PG-13 context, right? Horse shit. Exactly. Gotcha. If you want to be crass, I guess. I'm a crass dude. Man, Russia's looking pretty big. If I infiltrate their I really... administration, do you think I could get vision of them all the way to where their borders are? I don't know. Don't you get full vision? You I have, have no idea how that works. I've never used see it. see where all their armies are. I kind of don't want to risk it considering they're like the greatest part of my ally. The fog of war will be lifted from the target country. Yeah, so you should be able to see everything. All right, here we go. There's, uh, there's I would really like no to go down penalty. to speed, too, by the way. Sorry. Okay. okay. There's got really no penalty. Popping up and shit. To, um, to infiltrate an administration, they just catch you. There's no like opinion modifier for it. Really? No. Yeah. No, I think when it, it, it gets like minus 50 or something. Minus 15, mm -hmm. maybe. No. Mm. Try it. I'm not. I'm not messing with you. I'm no, serious. No, no, you are. Because France no, has caught I'm me not. like France has caught me like six times. Quill. Yeah. When we the uh, Battle Scar Galactica, did I ever lie? Uh. Am I on? <laughs> am I an honest person? Is yes. I'm not responding That's to honest. this appeal to emotion. I've uh, I've read the it's text on the screen. You, you should believe me. I'm telling you the truth. There is no penalty. Well, I'll tell you what. When France catches me, we can confirm or deny that. Sure. We'd lose someone from, uh, I guess, Hello? Mathis. Hello? Hello? Oh, hey, Lord. Hello? Mathis. I paused it. I paused it. Did it pause for you, too? Yes. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yes. So it was just Skype? <laughs> yeah, it was just Skype. Oh, Jesus fucking... My, my whole computer's just like, fuck everything today. <laughs> Get it together, man. Sorry, man. All right. Oh, we're fine. Yeah, we're good. We're we'll the game did everything which episodes. is like... Surprising. The most important part, <laughs> yeah. It's my truce with the Ukraine. Ah, 11 years, yeah. Of course it is. You know, I miss the time where goods produced modified your manpower. I that know. Made, that made it feel like the uh, manufactories were worth a lot more. Now it's <clears throat> very questionable. Long-term investment. Very long-term. I don't have a new university yet, but I don't think it's time to build that anymore. Yeah, I also wish there was a better way of understanding which unique buildings you don't have and which buildings you just can't afford or build. Like, mm -hmm. not very clear. Yeah. Buildings. I know, right? That's where I could put some money. I wasn't spending, well, only 80 ducats a month on my army. That's not so bad. 80 ducats a month? Yeah. That's a lot. It was 150 during the war with France. It was a nightmare. Mine's 83 right now. I could bring it down, though, now that I don't really have any rebels. Do, do, do. 
Oh, wow. There's the timer. Are you still with us, Mavis? I'm here. All right. I'm trying to... I think I'm trying to cut off their uh, capital. Who is uh, even, do we like... Wanna, the do next... we want to wrap this up now? I do, but, you know, we should come up with another... Um, AI goal to keep us busy for just a little bit longer. You know what I'm thinking? What are you thinking? Take Moscow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. The, the Ottomans? <laughs> no, no, take take Moscow. Uh, is It's called like Muscova. There it is. Yeah. Yeah. So we'd only have to take about, you know, half a dozen provinces each off of Russia. I'd give you guys military I access. Through, uh, I can come in through Scandinavia. Yeah, it's a short Boom. walk. All right, it's probably not going to happen. We're in a good place, though. Something to yeah, consider. Yeah, yeah. I think it's yeah. something to consider. I'm a good spot. Uh, although I would like you guys to declare first. In any case, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. And of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye. See you soon.